Hi everyone, this is your reading for Tuesday the 10th of March 2015. Let's have a look at what's coming up for you on this day. And I'm using the um, Tarot of the Animal Lords here today. Let's see what's coming up for you. First card is the Knave of Chalices. Then it's the Two of Wands. And then it's the Six of... Oh, it's the Lovers in Reverse. Okay. So... You start the day feeling very good, you're smelling the flowers, you feel at peace and serene within yourself, you're meek and humble and everything is wonderful and you're grateful for the good in your life. You start to ponder a decision that you are wanting to make and you can see the person making the decision or the animal making the decision here is a lion and a lion can be quite ferocious. It may seem that there's a decision that's up ahead that may rob you of your peace that may rob you of your peace of mind, and you may be reluctant to do that. And the lovers in reverse represents going against your own beliefs and values and feeling like you have to do something that you don't want to do. So my suggestion to you is to listen to your own inner gut and to delay the decision and don't let yourself be forced into making a decision if you feel like it's going to be a lose-lose for you. Delay it. Um, Look at alternative options, but don't let yourself be forced into losing your peace of mind because of something that you feel like you have to do. And also, again, don't let yourself feel like you have to go against your own principles. So I think it's a day of having to stall a little bit. You know, sometimes in business or in relationships, we're asked to make quick decisions under pressure. And sometimes you have to make an excuse and kind of take yourself out of that rather than um, do something that you'll regret later on. Because sometimes when you buy a little bit of extra time, circumstances change and those tough decisions sometimes don't have to be made or things look different or look softer or gentler or whatever. So it's a, it's a, it's a, it's a good idea to stall a little bit today. One and two is three and then six is nine and nine is spirituality. Okay, so again, listen to your own inner voice, buy some time and look at the bigger picture here. Have a wonderful day. If you'd like a private reading with me, please get in touch via my website, gregoryscott.com. And please remember to subscribe to the channel. Have a great day and I'll speak to you soon.